Hi there, I'm Jeffrey Schmidt of Jeffrey Schmidt Music, and I've prepared a preamp shootout for everyone. I have, I currently have four preamps in my possession. The Day King Mic Pre 1, the Gap or Golden Age Project Pre 73 DLX preamp, the RME Fireface UC, so there are preamps that exist within that audio interface. And I also have another audio interface, which is the Yamaha AG03. So in the next section of this video, we're going to look at my Fender acoustic bass, my Fender Kingman acoustic bass, recorded by the Electro Voice RE20 dynamic microphone into these four preamps, followed by the Warm Audio WA76 compressor. Let's get to it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the acoustic bass shootout. And now we're going to pass on to the acoustic guitar. So in this next, next segment, you're going to be listening to my Art & uh Dreadnought Cutaway Acoustic Guitar into the Bayer Dynamic MC930 Small Diaphragm Condenser Microphone into one of these four preamps followed by the Warm Audio WA-76 compressor. Now that we've gone through the acoustic guitar, next we're going to listen to some electric bass. So in this upcoming segment, you're going to be listening to the Sire P7 P bass into the Ampeg BA112 amplifier recorded by the Electro Voice RE20 dynamic microphone, followed by one of these four preamps into the WA-76 Warm Audio Compressor. And now in this next segment, we're going to be listening to my Fender Pawn Shop 51 electric guitar set on the uh, neck single coil pickup into my Ibanez TSA 15H mini stack 
recorded by a Shure SM58 dynamic microphone. And lastly, you're going to be hearing my vocals into the Mojave MA201 large diaphragm condenser microphone. And when I disappear, I know you'll still be here, and, and yet you'll never show a sign. And when I disappear, I know you'll still be here, and, and yet you'll never show a sign. And when I disappear, I know you'll still be here, and, and yet you'll never show a sign. And when I disappear, I know you'll still be here, and and yet you'll never show a sign. So there you go. Um, I am going to be putting the uh, timestamps in the comments section as usual. And um, I have done many videos on my channel on the, these preamps, on my thoughts on them, and on the various equipment that I'm using also in terms of performing this preamp shootout for all of you guys. So if you want to know more, there will be links in the description where you can learn more about any of this equipment if you want to know more via different videos on my channel. And if not, if you're only interested in one source or one preamp, then check the timestamps in the comment section below so that you can navigate through the different parts of this video. And there you have it. And if you enjoyed this video, please give me a like, a thumbs up, and um, let me know as well what you preferred on each source in terms of preamps. I have my own personal favorites, but I'd be interested in hearing which preamps all of you preferred on which sources, if you have favorites, or if you have experience with any of this equipment or any of these preamps, please let me know below in the comments section. Have a good day.